What's up guys, that's the Netgear Orbi 770. It's a Wi-Fi 7 mesh system. It's designed to increase Wi-Fi coverage throughout your home. So I'm going to run some speed tests on it, both on Wi-Fi and on Ethernet. So this Orbi is on wireless backhaul, which means that this is the Orbi satellite. As you guys can see, it's only hooked up to power. And this Orbi satellite is wirelessly talking to the main Orbi router, which is about 25 to 30 feet away or so and it, there are a couple walls in between. So I'm currently running a speed test on my Mac Mini, which has a Wi-Fi 6E card. So it's not a Wi-Fi 7 card on the Mac Mini, it's Wi-Fi 6E, otherwise it would go a little bit faster, or maybe actually a lot faster. Uh, so we got 1.16 down and 1.26 up, uh, which is pretty good overall. Uh, now here's the kicker. So some of the questions I get asked is, it's like, do I need Wi-Fi 7 devices to get a Wi-Fi 7 mesh system? And the answer is no. You can actually get a pretty big advantage. So I'm gonna connect an ethernet cable that's hooked up to my Mac Mini, and my Mac Mini has a 10 gig card on there, so I can support speeds of up to 10 gig, and I'm going to connect it to this wireless backhaul uh, satellite. Now, even though this is wirelessly talking to the main router, I can still use the ports. And in fact, when I do use the ports, it actually goes much faster. So I'm actually going to disable the Wi-Fi right now, and I'm going to kick off another speed test. Now, my internet speeds happen to be five gigabits per second upload and download. However, the Orbi itself, the 770, can't go faster than 2.5 gigabits. So 2.5 is the absolute mass maximum it can actually go and as you guys can see I'm pretty much getting nearly those two point not quite but very very close to those speeds so the fact of the matter is that if you have an Ethernet connected device and you connect it to that you can literally get just about maximum speeds um, literally connecting to a wireless backhaul node. And this is the beauty of Wi-Fi 7. Uh, and with the Orbi 970, you can go much faster because that one, uh, the, ports are, the ports on it are up to 10 gigabits, so I can actually reach at least the download speed. I do get to the five gig speeds. But overall, very, very impressed. Um, very impressive router overall. So up, if you have internet speeds of up to 2.5 gigabits, it's a really good choice. So. Hopefully you guys found this video helpful. If you guys did, smash that subscribe button and I'll catch you guys in the next one.